Poco F5, Redmi Note 12 Pro 5G, Paranoid Android, U8 Vegeta, Android version 14 year. This is a beta 5 build. April 1, 2024 is the play system update and Android security patches. July 5, 2024. Kernel use series 5.10.214. Kernel has been used. Build number you can see. This is the latest build available with July security patch. And the southern typical home skin and app drawer and some of the apps pre installed. Some of them I have installed. This is quick settings toggles. In the edit section, you also get some more options. You guys see on the screen. App active status can be seen here. And power menu, as you can see, the animation and settings. Very simple, guys. I think Arrow OS has been completely gone now. In that place, this is there, Paranoid Android UH Beta. I think so. I'm not sure. Again, into system gestures, you get all the necessary options like swipe to three finger screenshot of 100 more, double tap on fingerprint sensor if you want. You can add some of the options here, like what we have seen in Pixel devices. You can enable those things. Some customizations are there, very limited, I can say. Again, thermal profiles options are also given. And uh, yeah, that's how it is. Very simple. Google Maps and location, everything working fine. Security and privacy, again, you get face, fingerprint unlock. No app lock or anything like that. You need to use third party apps. And you can see the fingerprint unlocking speeds. It's quite fast and accurate. Now the face unlock, it's even faster than the fingerprint unlock. And you get some more options here. You can check out location. I already explained. Accessibility menu, which is my personal favorite. Many of them don't know about this without actually using the physical volume buttons. You can actually access from here. You can go through that and even brightness without sliding down. It will be a handy feature, guys. You should definitely use in this kind of ROMs. Again, you get some more options like color correction and display size and text based upon your liking. You can do that. Audio description, flash notifications, all Android 14 features are pre included here. Wallpaper sound style again, lock screen customizations are given here. And in the home screen, you can also get some more wallpapers here. But I have downloaded different wallpaper from where I will be showing you within a while. And themed icons is given upgrade, you get up to 16 to 6. Our system icon, this remains very similar. Display settings again, automatic brightness sensor working fine. I have just disabled that. Provincial accidental wake up is given dark theme again if you enable there is a pitch black condition as you can see I really like that if they would have been added to increase the pill and thunder days, but still it's okay as you can see Unless until I can access the 100 model. I don't have a problem with the pill again this black theme it should be there because Just I'll show you it doesn't look like it's a pure black theme once you enable that as you can see that pitch black condition I always Record these two options are must for me. Again, let me know in the comment section what is your must option in custom rooms like EOS rooms. Colors options, you get all these options. RGB strength, you can adjust, start or refresh skin and refresh rate. Adaptive refresh rate has been given. High touch polling rate, I have already enabled. Sound and vibration, you get all the necessary options like spatial audio using phone and wired earphones. Phone ringtone and everything remains same here. Live captions, smart pass, vibration and haptics individually. You can adjust the intensity, Dolby Atmos is given. It's very similar to what we get in other song. And the battery again, battery life is going to be very good here. And performance mode, if you want to turn this on, you might lose some extra juice. Charging control is given. Once you have that, you get three different options like limit charging, custom schedule, and automatic schedule. Based on the options you get. And coming into some of the apps, principal as I was speaking about the wallpapers, I use this abstract wallpapers. From here, I downloaded some of the wallpapers. Some of them are free, some of them are paid, but I recommend to use paid free versions. Again, you guys can see. And camera applications, uh, you get this kind of camera here. Is it Leica integrated? I don't think so. It's not Leica integrated. Video mode, again, you get 4K 30 only, no 60 option. These are the options you get. hyper -res camera. Everything is working fine, guys. If you want to use any Gcam parts like in EGC, LMC, I have already made a dedicated video for this Poco F. I have to install that. Check those videos again. And I have made a complete one and a half hour review of this smartphone. You can check out in the 
channel again if you want to follow me on the social media check out description there is a whatsapp separate group available for this poco f5 device that group link is also given in the description check out description always and link to windows this is nothing but just you can install the app and use in any of the roms here again this is typical home screen you also get these options like home settings you get this launcher and we'll show some results here you guys can see 100 benchmark going 10 lakhs 56,379 is good score again 1.8 degrees Celsius is the temperature is and 5 percentage of battery has been dropped and I use this version of anti 2 and this is geek pain score 1501 is single score 3729 is a multi score again and version 14 links 5.10.214 and 12 kernel has been used here and this is safety net status results both getting fast and device is certified using payment applications is not at all a problem in this room and this is regarding Dombey vision and level 1 certification your thing is fine watching OTT application is also not a problem in this particular room guys again this all read and speed test this is with Wi-Fi connection I have Airtel 200 Mbps plan it's pulling up 220 and this is with 5G Geo and it's pulling up to 300 and charging rapidly 33 sorry 67 watt charging support is available in this wrong guys this is how it looks like very smooth guys the interface is smooth lighter and good for battery life this I can say let's see BGM how it handles in this particular ROM you guys can say this is the volume panel what we can get in this room graphics and audio again you get extreme options here no need to worry regarding that device this hi-fi device and very good for fun sleep and spread I'll decrease a little bit of volume here and there is a slight lag as you can see maybe my Wi-Fi connection is in yeah I can able to get killed at least yeah that is how it is and again there is my another channel guys regarding my dog and all you guys can see Jack Sparrow you can subscribe to that other channel also my personal channel actually is playtime now she allowed me to make the video the gaming experience is fine here but again I am not going to say it's a gaming drama or anything like that and are we asking to finish that gaming video and let's go outside this thing anyhow this is how the gaming experience case you also get this fps option also i can able i'm sure you you guys can see yeah there is no lag whatsoever the gaming experience is fine again say again i can't name it as a gaming room but still you get a very good performance in this particular bomb base that's how it is I will come back here and this is the speed test second dialer they would have been added basic call recording that's not available here you guys can see on the screen but overall it's a very good wrong base for Poco F5 very light smooth experience you can expect for this Poco F5 this is Sampath guys you are watching Sampath SanFX YouTube channel we will meet you with another interesting video until that keeps smiling bye bye for now